Hi beauty, how are you doing? I hope you are doing very well. Happy New Year, Happy New Year once again. Welcome back to another tutorial. If it's your first time to cross by, thank you, thank you so much. You are welcome. My name is Glory Mtui and please before you leave, don't forget to subscribe, like this video and leave your comment in comment section. Straight away to the video I started with the very clean hair i wash my hair a day before and here i'm doing only four lines so i started to divide the line i want to do but here is cross the line i don't know how to call this hairstyle but the first line cross almost end of my face shape going back Take your time to make your line slowly, slowly. Here I have two mirror, one front and one back so that I can get my line well. So after that, I go ahead and divide a small, small section. I will use rubber band to secure and then later when I start to do this style, I will remove this rubber band because in this hairstyle, no need to use rubber band. But I just... Put it there to secure my section so that when I start to braid, I will not tag the section together. So after I finish to divide this section and secure them with rubber band, this is the length of the yarn I will use each section one two three only three and in one section and after that i remove rubber band and i hold my yarn over here very small then i attach it on my hair and then i start wrapping when you are wrapping please don't tie your hair too much you cause too much tension and in this hairstyle no need to feel Pain. this is a very comfortable protective hairstyle so honey when you are wrapping slowly slowly don't tie your hair too much just simple and this style work perfect then I continue wrapping till end of my hair and then I secure like this another three pieces I remove elastic band And then I start wrapping just slowly slowly wrapping I mean don't wrap too tight slowly slowly continue wrapping till the length you feel like this one is okay if your hair is more short of course you have to put the yarn more long I mean the side you attach with your natural hair you have to put more long so that you'll get more long length then after here I secure this the first section will go under under and I hold them together then I continue wrapping you may put your section under just like the same way I do but also you can put up depending on which where it's easy for you to achieve this hairstyle but no matter you put each section under each other or you put up of each other all this way this style come out the same so after i finish i remove the place i tie i secure the previous one remove elastic band and then here i divide each section into two so that I can give my section very natural look and then I use the same yarn to continue wrapping I continue wrapping slowly slowly then when almost end of my hair I secure the section and then I secure it over here I remove elastic band and then 
I continue. Sometimes you may find the length you put is a little bit short or long. If you feel it's short, you have to continue wrapping so that the section can be close to the next one. Then divide your section into two. Put the previous section in the middle and then continue wrapping. This is how this style go. Here is the end of the yarn. So I add three pieces more and then I continue wrapping. If you start with two strand of yarn, it means every time when you add, you have to add two. If in the beginning you start with three strand, wherever or four, every time when you add, you have to add just the same amount of yarn you started with. And I find every time when I secure the previous uh, section, it will be easy for me to see the direction I'm going with. More than to leave the previous section hanging there, it's very easy to feel confused. So every time when you are braiding this hairstyle, you have to make sure the previous section every time you secure it well on top so that you will see the direction you are going. then this is the last section and i only wrap several times and then i take the last one i mean the previous one i hold them together continue to wrap the last section then i continue with the same yarn then i continue wrap till end and then i secure it over here and it depends with the length you want if you want the yarn be more long, I mean the tail, of course you have to continue wrapping. When you are dividing this small section, you may decide Either you want more smaller than mine or you want bigger than mine. That is your option. Just go with the way you feel you are comfortable to do, honey. Here, no specific um, amount of the section you are supposed to braid. And in this line i'm going to show you how i hold my back section how i braid so that i can get just the same direction with the same direction i started with so honey keep watching and if you have any questions so far leave your question in comment section and i'll answer all the question yes i will try as much as i can to answer all the questions So divide the section into two, then I put this previous section in the middle, then I continue wrapping. After I wrap till end, then I secure the section. Remove elastic band, divide the section into two, put middle and then continue wrapping. Okay, so here we are in back section. <laughs> Take your time, dear, slowly, slowly. When you are doing back section, first you have to make sure you have two mirrors so that you can see direction you are going with if it's the same direction you started with or it's different so that you can fix it well easy but here you may decide to wrap all 
direction i mean the way you feel it's easy for you to continue wrapping this section so here i wrap like this way here yarn finish so i add and i continue just the same way like the way i started the difference over here is the way i'm wrapping here i wrap going up i mean i hold the yarn i wrap like this way but in front you can decide either go right or left then i secure it and then i make sure i see the previous section and i see the direction i go before i secure any section another thing you have to remember very well the direction you started with to make it easy for you to continue braid back if you still remember you start going under it means even in back you continue go under whether you see it or you cannot see because you don't have maybe two mirror but if you remember i'm going under it means it will be easy for you to continue doing this hairstyle here what you're supposed to do is only to change the direction of your hand just put your hand in different angles so that it will be easy for you to continue wrapping your section because it's back and you cannot see it like very clear like front so every time when you hold the section you have to make sure you didn't tag any excess hair you must make sure the section you are tagging is the section you are supposed to hold together if you feel like you tag more excess hair from other section of course you have to clean it before you start wrapping here i almost end of this line and uh, you see very well like how i braid because a lot of people that have been asking me me like glory how you braid your back section can you make a video for us that's why i decided to show like everything everything how i start till end when you are finished don't forget after you wrap your last section several times, then hold the previous section together, then continue wrapping with the same yarn you are wrapping. But here you have to take only three yarn. Others just keep there so that you can get other yarn to wrapping. I'm done with this style and let me go ahead and trim off all the excess yarn fix my edges then we will continue with our video honey you may decide to leave this tail like this or you may decide to spice it up a little by adding some mali hair just fewer like this one secure it over there and then attach this hairband up there twist this hair so that you get a good shape and then wrap it over there finish no need a bobby pin nothing if you wrap it well nothing i hope you enjoy watching this video and you get something please don't forget to like this video subscribe and leave your comments in comment section i love you guys so much and i will see you soon on my next video bye bye